Around this time every Thursday, we go to our Skin Direct line and talk to Mr. Skin from www.mrskin.com, the best website on the WWWs. And Skin is like Rain Man when it comes to nudity. (laughs) That's why we love him. And he brings us all the latest news in nudity in film and TV and, well, you name it. It's all over the place. Skin, how you doing? Doing real good, real good. Good. Busy times, busy times. Absolutely. Now, Skin, um, you know I love your site, and I'm there all the week, every week. What do you have for us this week? Well, I thought you guys would find this interesting. There's a, a new movie was just released two days ago on Amazon. It's called The Space Between. It's kind of a drama comedy, dramedy. And it's um, set in the distant past of L.A. in the 90s. And Kelsey Grammer stars as this guy. He's like a has-been musician from the Peace and Love 60s. And is, he's, in a, he's still in the record business, or the music business. But um, that's all fine and good. But what's really interesting in this, there's one nude scene in the movie. And it's done by Paris Jackson. Does that ring a bell? Paris. As in Michael Jackson's daughter? Michael Jackson's daughter? Michael Jackson's daughter. It's a real thriller of a nude scene. I'll tell you. <laughs> really good. Oh, oh, skin, she's an actress? <laughs> yeah, well, it's, yeah, she's sort of. She's in this. Um, uh, it's actually pretty cool. And um, I just thought it's weird. Like, we remember when, like, she, she was a little kid. Now she's all grown up and doing nude scenes in a movie. So, right. Uh, yeah, pretty wild. I, I did not see that coming, and uh, it, it just came out two days ago, so you could check that out at MrSkin.com. All right, and has that aired yet? Did you say, is it... Um... It just came out two days ago on VOD, so we were all over it, and uh, um, it, it's How actually like pretty skin? cool. How do you like Skin? How do you like this? I mean, he's all over That's it. cutting I, edge right yeah, there. That is cutting edge. What else you got for us this week, well, Skin? Uh, well, a couple things. Um, one is, um, there's a, uh, just one show I wanted to get you guys up to speed with called Dom on Amazon. And it's an, um, and when you think of the word Dom, it's, it's, you're probably going the completely different direction with chains and whips and all that other stuff. Right. But th- yeah, this is a, an Amazon Prime series about this leader of a criminal drug cartel in, in Brazil. And, um, What's interesting is he's this kid has a lot going for him, handsome, good looking kid, but he he he's he gets into the world of cocaine and, and becomes a big shot and it's all fine except for the fact that his dad is a um uh, a, a captain in the police intelligence service in uh, Brazil, but uh-huh. all that—it's a—it's a cool show. But boy, they had some great nudity. And since it's from Brazil, you guys aren't going to know the names. Like you won't know the actresses. But trust me, I mean, a Brazilian uh, gorgeous women—you can't go wrong. The show's called Dom on Amazon, and uh, you can check that out. Also, you guys remember Adrian Barbeau. We're of the same age. We were as kids. We remember Adrian Barbeau. She I turned... remember Adrian Barbeau. Now, what was she in, though? I mean, well, she was on a TV you. show. Well, I remember all, that. Yeah, she turned 76 over the weekend, which oh. was kind of weird. I <laughs> okay. know. But she was the daughter. Don't forget, she was Maude's daughter on That's the great right. TV show <laughs> Maude in the okay. 70s. Uh, B. Arthur's daughter. But remember, like, Escape from New York uh, and, and with Kurt Russell and then Cannonball Run films with Burt Reynolds? Yes. She was always showing incredible cleavage. So if you want to know where to see her nude, she did a movie called Swamp Thing in 1982. Now, if you went to the theater, there was no nudity in that movie. If you rented it on VHS in the 80s or 90s, there was no nudity. But in the late 90s, they put out a DVD and they added an extra scene that had never been released before. And it was Adrian Barbeau waiting topless in the swamp. And uh, what an incredible bonus. Who saw that coming? And uh, it's the best place to see Adrian Barbeau uh, nude. Needless to say, she had no chance of drowning in that swamp. Uh, (laughs) So uh, anyway, um, it was a great news. And and while we're on the subject of great moments in added nude scenes, uh, when I'm asked if Barbara Streisand Sand has ever been nude. Um, the answer is, well, is interesting. I was just oh, going to say, has she ever been nude? 
Well, it's an interesting answer. Um, so she did a movie in 1970 called The Owl and the Pussycat with George Siegel. And he plays a stuffy author, and he enters into this explosive relationship with this neighbor who's this foul-mouthed prostitute played by Barbara Streisand. And the problem is... Um, so if you saw the movie, no nudity. If you rented the movie on VHS in the 80s or 90s, no nudity. If you rented the DVD when it came out, no nudity. But if you were smart like me and got the <laughs> Japanese laser disc <laughs> version. Oh, oh my God. That's spectacular. They added um, a never before. I had been tipped off that a, a scene that was filmed that never released at any other place was it was in the Japanese laser disc and you could see it's like two seconds but you could see Barbara Streisand topless in the scene and uh, it, we have it at MrSkin.com it is one of the rarest of rare nude scenes uh, luckily I had a laser disc player at the time in the 90s and hey, I found it hey so don't laugh cool. Tonelli still has one and uses yeah, one right. absolutely <laughs> Trades laser discs, right? <laughs> yes, I salute Mr. Skin That's for right. his the best. His research on Barbara Streisand and exclusive her nude or topless, and uh, I salute Tonelli for still keeping the laser uh -huh, laser yeah. player alive. Never yeah. know when it'll make he's, a comeback. He's, <laughs> he's polishing his laser disc later today. So yes. <laughs> laser oh disc God. and flip phone. You can't beat him for technology skin. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Now those are good. those are great moments in nudity. I'm glad I was able to share it with you. All right, there we go. The great Mr. Skin. Incredible. Have a good one, Skin. There you, you go. Guys, bye. <laughs> He's Even legendary. A guy who's picking up nude scenes from Laserdisc is making fun of you, Paul. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. He got the Japanese Laserdisc. Like, that's right. impressive. That is commitment. Right. That really is. The man knows and is dedicated to his craft of bringing <laughs> nude scenes from movies to you.